Hello everyone. Exercise 1.3, question number 9. Classify the following number as rational or irrational. I already told that irrational number are basically non-terminating and non-repeating. When I'm saying non-terminating and non-repeating, that means that all these numbers are which do not have a bar or the sign above the digits. This actually means the digits are repeating and when we write dash dash dash, it means that the digits are not repeating and there is no bar. Here also it is 478, 478. So these digits are actually repeating themselves. This can also be written as 7.478 with a bar. While in this question, there is one zero, then one with two zeros, then one with three zeros. The number of zeros are keep on increasing. So this cannot be said as non-terminating. I, I know that when there is a dash, after this, it means it is a non-terminating decimal, but it is not a repeating decimal. So, if we have to classify as rational and irrational, then in the decimal shape, we have to understand that all the numbers which are non-terminating and non-repeating decimals are irrational. So, this is an irrational number. This is a repeating decimal, so this is a rational number. This is again can be written as 4, 7, add with 8 with a bar. That means this is also a rational number. Here it is a terminating number. So all numbers which are terminating or non-terminating repeating, they are known as rational number so this is a terminating number because it is only four digits four digits after the decimal place so this is also a rational number when i talk about under root it is very clear that under root of p it depends on the value of p if p is a perfect square then this is rational if p is not a perfect square then it is irrational here the term 23 is not a perfect square so this will be treated as irrational number while under root of 225 this 225 is a square of 15 so this can be written as under root of 15 into 15 and can be written as plus or minus 15 so this is known as a rational number so this way we can define the rational and irrational number in question number 10 insert an irrational number between the following we have to be very clear that what we are inserting we have to insert an irrational number or a rational number so here when we have to insert an irrational number between two factors so it is 1 upon 3 and it is 1 upon 2 this can also be written as 1 upon under root of 9 and this can be written as 1 upon under root of 4 so all the numbers between them are known as irrational numbers which are having the denominator as under root but here it should not be a perfect square like 4 is a perfect square and 9 is a perfect root square so these two are rational numbers but if I am writing under root of 8 so 1 upon under root 8, 1 upon under root 7, 1 upon under root 6 and 1 upon under root 5 all these are irrational numbers so when we have to insert any one so we can write any one of the following again when we talk about minus 2 upon 5 and 1 upon 2 so this is basically minus 4 upon 25 in under roots and this is basically under root of 1 upon 4 so all the numbers which are below this and positive numbers definitely are known as irrational numbers so when i am writing as 1 upon under root of 5 because the denominator is more than 4 that means that this number will be treated as a number which is less than 1 upon 4 under root or less than 1 upon 2 
one upon under root of five, one upon under root of six, one upon under root of seven. All these numbers are basically the irrational numbers between this and this. When I am talking about in the decimal format, zero and zero point one. It means any number between these two will be an irrational number, which is a non-perfect square with the under root. So if I am writing something like point zero three zero three zero three and so on, this is a rational number. But if I write point zero three zero zero three zero 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 three and so on, definitely this number is less than point one and greater than zero. So any number of this format can be written as irrational number between the two. This can also be written as under root of point zero 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 four. This number, if I take under root, becomes point zero two. So this value is definitely less than 0.1 and greater than zero. So when this is a perfect square, if instead of four I am writing five, it becomes irrational number. So under root of 0.0006, under root of 0.0007, all these numbers are between zero and 0.1 and are known as irrational number because these are non-perfect squares. So this way. We have solved the question number nine and ten. In the next video, we'll talk about question number eleven onwards. If you have any problems or doubts, you can email or contact us. Thank you.